It's Pride Month, and for that reason, I want to go down memory lane and look back at how different stars have announced that they are part of the LGBTQ plus community. I'm Freddie Lomeli, and this is a Latinx Now Breakdown. On June 17, 2020, 30-year-old Pablo Alboran published his I Have Something to Tell You video on IGTV, where he confessed that he's homosexual and that he needed, as he stated, to be a little bit happier than what I am already. Plus, he also explained that he had always felt free to love whomever he wanted and never felt discriminated against for being himself. But he knew that was not everyone's reality and wished that with his coming out, the path for others would be a little bit smoother. Such a great example. Similarly, the former Fifth Harmony band and member Lauren Haregi decided to share that she's bisexual in 2016 by writing an open letter on Billboard. The open letter discussed issues of race, inclusivity, and discrimination, and in it, Lauren stated, quote, I am a bisexual Cuban-American woman, and I am so proud of it. I'm also proud to be part of a community that only projects love and education and the support of one another. Some powerful words, and the bi community doesn't get a lot of love. Good on her. We can't forget Demi Lovato's recent declaration as non-binary. Just last month, the singer and actress declared on the first episode of her podcast 4D that, quote, over the past year and a half, I've been doing some healing and self-reflective work. And through this work, I've had the revelation that I identify as non-binary. With that said, I'll be officially changing my pronouns to they, them. I love it. Our community is so broad. Good on Demi Lovato for representing for all our non-binary friends. And of course, we also have Ricky Martin, who's not only a worldwide superstar and trailblazer in the music industry, but also within the LGBTQ plus community. The 49-year-old Boricua confessed that he was gay in a much different time than the one we live in today. And although he is happy to have done it when he did, he recently revealed that it was not easy for him to do it back then, and he faced a lot of hardships at the time, some of which still haunt him to this day. Yeah, that took some guts, because when he did it, yeah, the world wasn't so open about it. Another superstar who's also a music icon is Emily Estefan. Yes, one of Gloria and Emilio Estefan's daughters. The 26-year-old singer came out to her parents in 2017 and confessed that although her parents are big advocates for equality and strong supporters of the LGBTQ community, it was a very challenging time for her family. But despite that, in 2020 she said that just like Pablo Alboran, she hopes that her story helps people around the world because, open quote, the same way that there are little gay kids that need to hear my side of the story, there are parents who love their kids to death and they just don't understand what they need at the moment. Boy, it's never easy coming up to parents. I know firsthand. So friends, now it's my time to go and celebrate Pride in my own way, but these were just a few of the A-listers who are here to inspire us on stage, on screen, and in our everyday lives. Always showing that there's no right or wrong way to live your life. It's all about chasing dreams and finding your happiness. Do you, boo? I'm Freddie Lomeli, and this was the Latin X Now Breakdown. Ciao for now. Ey, 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 tú, tú, tú ahí. No te vayas. ¿Te gustó el clip? Entonces suscríbete para seguir riendo y jugando con nosotras. Aquí la pasamos espectacular y obviamente hablamos de todas las noticias del mundo Latinx y lo más trendy. Entonces dale click y no te pierdas nada de Latinx Now. Ahí está. Click, suscríbete, like, comment, click, click, all click, all click, all click, all click, all click, 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 click